Hello everyone! It's a new day and a new week here at ISYC and this is your daily announcement for today, Monday, October 12, 2020. We hope you were able to read our letter regarding our culminating activity slated on October 31 entitled Un Poco Loco Fiesta. We have planned out special activities for your children on this special day. However, we will need your help in pre-making the guitar that will be used for our sing and dance along. So please gather up the materials that will be needed for this purpose that you can easily find in your homes. This include one shoe box or cereal box or tissue box and one kitchen tissue paper tube or two tissue cores joined together. Please remember to have your plain guitar ready before October 31. Thank you very much for all your help. For our student feature today, let's take a look at the kinder activity that involves rainbow xylophone. Let's take a look. Here's Adam and his rainbow xylophone. Terence Soleta enjoyed playing his water xylophone. He was amazed to know that putting the different amounts of water inside the bottles can create such nice and different sounds. Nigel Lequanen likes to try different sounds using his water xylophone. He tried playing while singing the happy birthday song. Let's listen. Nicole Likwanen as she enjoys playing music using the jars with different colors and different amounts of water to the tune of Twinkle Twinkle Little Star. Here's Kate Negrino playing Helping Twilight Win the Crown from My Little Pony Equestria Girls. Since Halloween is just around the corner, we will have the rest of October's joke of the day with a Halloween theme. Are you ready? Let's begin. What is a witch's favorite subject in school? Again, what is a witch's favorite subject in school? Try to guess. Any guesses? Well, the witch's favorite subject in school is none other than spelling. Get it? Today, there are 74 days left before Christmas. Now, as you know, every person can use his or her head, heart, and hands to make this world a better place. I truly believe that we all have the power to make a change, even if it is small, and you really never know what that change may mean to someone else. So for the rest of October, let's do a family challenge of keeping kindness in our radar. This way, you can make memories while serving others together as a family. So today, your family act of kindness is to educate your family about recycling. By learning about recycling, you're not only teaching your children about taking care of the environment, but also you are passing on the baton of responsibility for a cleaner, eco-friendly future on to the next generation. So gather your family tonight for a discussion on recycling. 
Again, any act of kindness, whether big or small, can always make a difference. And this has been your daily announcement for today, October 12, 2020. I'll see you again tomorrow. Bye!